Roses, it's Sugar Rose Studios, and I am, oh my god, like, literally, this box just came all the way from Germany. Oh my god. And there are horses in here I've been waiting so long to get, you don't even know. And, um, this took, I think, a month to get here, which, I mean, you know... I've been waiting. I literally wish I lived in Germany because the shipping for this is so expensive. And like, I love WIA models and they came out with different WIA models like in different colors. And I was like, oh my God, I need to get that. All right, so let's cut this open because <laughs> I'm so excited. Grab tonight, okay. Gosh, I got a Chalet catalog. So, my order. Ooh, I got a certificate for having for getting this model. That's actually really cool. Okay. Yeah, let's not look at how much money I spent. Okay. Let's start. I don't even know what's here. Bubble wrap. That's very good. Can use this for. My, my orders. Okay, so first we have a Lancelot, who is my actually my favorite model ever. Um, I am going to probably do a repaint on this one, because or on the one that I have. He is just stunning. Love this model to death, like guys. He is just gorgeous. The material on this model, and this is like like size, by the way. The the material on this model is like incredible. I can't. It's like so like it's like a nice quality. I don't know. Okay, and then we have my other Sharif because my other my Sharif that I have broke. His ear was broken, so I wanted to get another one, but I thought I ordered the gray one. Maybe I ordered both and I just forgot. I guess that's what happened. Um, so, so yeah, he comes in two colors now. I have a dapple gray version and this is the black version. He is so Stunning. I can't wait for next year's WIA models to come out because these two, like in addition to Gustav, were just perfect. And I think I got another Gustav because I'm gonna cuss them in. Um, yeah, so. This is, ah, the gray one, which is awesome. The double gray. Oh, wow, the color actually came out pretty good on him. I was a little concerned because I saw some people were like, oh, you had scratches and everything. And this one doesn't appear to have any flaws that I could see so far. Um, yeah, he's actually really adorable in this dapple gray color. Really like it. That's actually really cute. He's really, really, really adorable. So happy to have this model in another color too. I mean, they're just such high quality. I could literally collect like a million of them. And now I have one to repaint. So that's exciting. Okay, more bubble wrap. And that was, I think, most of the WAAs. I don't know. Um, or this might be another one. I can't remember what I ordered because it was a long time ago, but let's see what this is. Oh, this was the other color Lancelot. Okay, so this is his, this is the Bay version that they are selling now. So when I first got them, they were only selling them in one color. And now they're selling them in two colors. So I guess that's something that WAA is doing now. But like they're gonna sell one color and then they're gonna have a recolor, so. Gorgeous. Okay, he has a little scratch, but it's okay. 
He's super cute. I can't tell what color I like him better in, actually. I kind of like them both a lot. Okay. What else is in here? Ooh. Okay, so this was... This is the Saplin's replica horse that I have seen on so many people's Instagram and wanted so badly because it's super realistic and they only actually sell- <gasps> No! Oh my god, the tail is like cracked and broken. Oh guys, that's not good. Alright, that's really unfortunate because this model's super cute and I really like it, but mm, her tail is broken. Ah, uh, it's okay. I'll probably get a refund. Um, that's happened before, but um, I really like this model. Also, like a really nice plastic feel on it. It's like that WIA same like kind of thing. Super cute. Love that. I'm just so sad. It's broken. And of course, I had to get the matching full. So this full is so cute. It looks adorable and so happy. It is so cute. It, it just has so much personality, I think. Ah, has lots of gold things on its face, but you can see it's like skipping. I think that's just adorable. Um, okay, it also does not stand, so that's problematic. Um, okay, I'm pretty sure it should stand. Um, legs are a little bendy, so, or maybe it's I don't know what's happening there, but... Alright, we have a non-standing horse. Okay, this is just something that I ordered because I thought, like, why not? Because I'm not going to find it here in the United States anywhere. And it's just, like, adorable little scrunchy donkey. His face is, like, way more pushed in than I thought, though, so that's a little... I don't know. Not a big fan of this one, actually. It looked cuter in the picture, but it's kind of cute. I mean, I don't know. It doesn't really look like a donkey though. So, I don't know. Oh, this is a Mojo donkey. Okay, so I think the other horses are collectives. So this is the new Exmoor Collecta, which I really have wanted and seen. And it's actually pretty tiny. I don't know if Exmoors are really this small. I feel like Collecta really needs to work on their scaling because some horses are tiny and some horses are huge. So this is the Exmoor Collecto. It's really adorable. He's super cute. Um, I definitely love ponies, so any pony is a good pony for me, to be honest. And I don't know, this might be try and feel what this is. Oh, this is an extra Gustav. Love my Gustav. He's just so handsome. This one will be Probably my new keeper model, and then I'll repaint the one that I have. The one that I have is a little scratched up at this point. Um, I don't even know why. He's not play with my models or anything. I just collect them. But I think he fell on the ground or something. I don't really know. Plus, I think the paint job on this one is just better for some reason. So, he is gorgeous. Aww. He is so handsome. And he stands really well. Okay. What else did I order? Oh, this one I'm so excited about. This is the one with the dog on its back. Um, I wanted to order the one with the cat, but it didn't come out yet. I should have waited because the shipping is always about through here. But it's so cute. Oh my gosh, adorable. Look at the little terrier. I'm so sad it doesn't come off though. I wish that it was like removable, but still that is just so cute and it makes me so happy. I might custom it to make it like magnetic. I think I saw someone that did that, but it's gonna be a little tricky to get him off without killing anything. So that will be an interesting, interesting. Okay. Ah, this guy, I'm planning on doing a repaint on him, I think. Or maybe not, I don't know, it depends on how he turned out. So this is the Camarillo Stallion, or what is, how do you even say? Camarillo. Smells very plasticky. He's so cute. Oh my gosh. Just look at that face. He's so stunning. I love that. So adorable. Okay, and the last we can do. Oh, there's two more. Okay. 
This is the Mojo one, the one that I got the certificate for. Oh, wow. This is like, so this is the exclusive Boyland. Oh, it's a lot more bendy. The legs are a lot more bendy than I thought. But, oh my gosh, I love this. I'm not sure I'm a big fan of the tail, though. I don't know. The tail looks a little strange to me. Um, I feel like it needs, like, a little bit more detail, especially because the rest of the horse is just so pretty. But I really like this one, actually. I think it's, like, simple and just really gorgeous. And there's, like, a little marking on the butt. I don't know if you guys can see it, but it's, like, a little indentation. But it's pretty cute. The plastic feels weird to me, though. And the tail, I'm not liking that. I wish it was stiffer, like, the rest of the model. But other than that, I mean... Oh, it's a he. He's gorgeous. It's a gelding. Super cute. Okay. And last one. This is crazy. This is the Mojo. I think. What is this? Oh, this is, uh, yeah, this is Mojo. Um, I think a Hanoverian mare. This one is cute. I saw, um, Daisy Stalls did a repaint on this. Wow, the tail feels strange on that. Um, and I was really a big fan of it. I don't really like the paint job at all. Like the hose are like yellow, um, but I will definitely probably repaint this one eventually if I have time. <laughs> wow. Um, yeah, so let me turn around the camera and I'll show you guys all this amazing stuff. All right, so this is the little Southlands replica foal. I'm really sad that it doesn't stand. Like what is with that? Um, so this is the mare who is absolutely beautiful. I'm still so sad that the tail is broken. Oh my God. Um, yeah, so I don't know what I'll do with that. I guess I'll ask for a replacement. This is the Mojo, um, or sorry, the Bully Lion Horse. Wow, I keep saying Mojo. This is the Bully Lion Horse. Um, again, I think the tail is like weird. It's a little squishy, but, and overall I think it's pretty though. It's really smooth, like really nice to repaint this model. I would definitely think this would be a nice repaint. And this is the Lancelot in the bay color. I think he's really handsome in that color actually. And then this is him in the original pink color, which of course he's still my favorite. And then we have our Gustav who is just stunning of course. And then here are the two Sharifs. This is the black one that I already have, but his ear was broken. And then this is the gray one. I really like the gray one, honestly better than the black one. Um, so, ah, don't fall on me. I feel like the only downside to WIA models, oh my God. The only downside to WIA, mo WIA models is that they can break a little bit easily. This is the adorable little donkey with a little triple face. And this is the Camrillo, um, Collecta. I don't know. I might repaint this one. I was thinking of doing that originally. I don't know. It's the, I feel like he could use a cute color, but overall, I think this is a good model. This is the Exmoor Pony, which I think is super duper cute. Love it. It's a little small, though. I feel I felt like it was going to be a little bit bigger. And then this is the uh, horse with the terrier. Um, the mare, I think. Wait, what, what are you? The mare interior is just what it's called. So I don't know what breed this is, but I want to try and remove them without killing everything. And that might be difficult. And then lastly, we have this um, Mojo horse, which I'm definitely going to be repainting because I'm not a big fan of this color. And here's just an overview of all the ones. All right, Roses, thank you so much for watching this video. Go check out my website. I have a bunch of model horses for sale and you can also Fill out some forms and get a quote for a custom model that you are commissioning me for. And you can design it by yourself and send me what you want. And don't forget to stay sweet. Mwah.